Hi guys, I'm Ashley. Welcome to my very first fashion year class on Kira Kira, where I'll teach you how to hone your inner designer. With New York Fashion Week happening, I thought it might be cool to show you where some of today's top fashion trends come from, straight from the runway into our favorite Pinterest boards. You may have noticed that delicate and minimal gold stack rings are totally in. This actually started trending thanks to world-renowned fashion house Balenciaga back in the spring-summer show of 2013. Check out my mood board for inspiration. So let's get started with my Balenciaga inspired ring in Autodesk Fusion 360. Step one, creation of the band. Begin by Googling your US ring size in millimeters. Since both my pointer and middle fingers are a true size seven, I know that's 17.3 millimeters. As a general good habit, always start your designs off by saving the file. I'll be naming mine designer-stacked underscore rig. Be sure you're in the sculpt workspace by clicking the create dropdown and selecting create form. Make a cylinder in the top view centered around the origin, otherwise known as coordinates 00. zero. Now thicken the outside of the circle located in the modify dropdown. Two millimeters is the jewelry industry standard for what we call comfort fit. I find it helpful to name each form and folder in order to stay organized. Step two, creation of the pipe spline. Find the spline function under the sketch tab. Start the spline halfway through the band's thickness at one millimeter. Now add a point every 45 degrees following the circumference then add one millimeter along the band's edge for another half turn. Hide your band by turning the light bulb off under the body's drop down. Now, here's where you can customize your unique design. Once the anchors are deleted, each point can be moved to make an organic shape for the top of the band. Do this by right clicking and selecting the move copy function, or just type M on your keyboard as a shortcut. Select each white circle to ensure it turns blue, then drag it in the up direction, hitting enter every time. Get creative with where you want to place them. Once you're happy with its path, bring back our band for reference. Use move one more time to set the curve above the band. Now to make this curve an object, use the pipe tool. Set the global diameter to two millimeters, be sure smooth display is selected and that the end type is set to square. Step three, combining both. Finally, our pipe and band are ready to be fused together. Highlight both and click on finish form. This brings us to the model workspace. Time to fuse the whole design into one ring. Use the combine function found in the modify dropdown. Step four, export your STL file. Now that your band and unique pipe are fused together and ready to go, you can download the STL file. Right click and highlight the ring, then select export under the file name just below your browser menu. Name your design in STL format. All that's left to do is print your ring. Don't forget to upload your designs on kirakira.com to show our community what an awesome designer you are.